as far as miscarriages are concerned. It can be divided into two types. The first are those miscarriages and those fetus that, that die before four months. And the second are those fetus that die four months and after four months. As far as those fetus that die before four months, the scholars, they have said, the majority of the scholars, that as far as the fetus that die before four months, the scholars, they have said, that these fetus, generally before four months, there is no life in the fetus. So in this situation, there is no janaza to be offered on these fetus who have died before four months, nor any ghusl is required, nor is the shrouding required of these fetus. Whereas the fetus born after four months, that is approximately 120 days, so the majority of the scholars, they say that in this situation, after four months, the fetus has life in it. Generally, the fetus has life in it. So in this situation, the janaza salah is to be offered, the shrouding is to be done, the ghusl is to be done on this fetus, and this fetus is to be buried in the graveyard of the Muslims. And according to the standing committee of fatwa, fatawa al-lajna al daima in Saudi Arabia, even they have said that if a fetus is born before four months, then no janaza is to be offered, no janaza is to be offered, the shrouding is not to be done, and also the ghusl need not be done. Whereas if the fetus is born four months or after four months, then the janaza needs to be offered, the shrouding needs to be done, the ghusl needs to be done, and the child can also be named, and in fact, the aqiqah can also be done, which is the sunnah of our beloved Prophet Muhammad, may peace and blessings be upon him. So generally after four months, that is one to approximately 120 days, In this situation, the ahkam of janaza or generally the procedure that we follow after a person dies, all of these procedures are to be followed for the fetus who dies after four months, for the baby who dies after four months. And according to Sheikh Muhammad bin Salih al-Uthaymeen, even his opinion is that the fetus that dies before four months, no janaza is required to be offered, nor is the ghusl required and nor is the shrouding required, but if the fetus or the baby dies after four months, then the janaza, the shrouding, the ghusl needs to be done. So as, far, so as far as your question is concerned, you have asked regarding the children, the fetus born after 120 days, that is after four months, so in this situation, all of the procedures that you do after a person passes away, according to the Sharia, you need to do it on, you need to do it for this fetus, including the janaza salah, including the ghusl, including the shouting. And also the aqiqah can be done, which is a sunnah, and also the child can be named. And the child is to be buried in the graveyard of the Muslims. So I hope that answers the question.